I want to start off by saying how embarrassed and ashamed I am for disappointing my family, my teammates, my coaches, and the entire UCLA community. I feel terrible, and I'm sorry to everybody who I've let down. With that being said, I take full responsibility for the mistake I have made, shoplifting. I know that this goes beyond me letting my school down, but I've let the entire country down. Before, before I thank everybody who worked so incredibly hard to help us return home safely, I want to thank the Chinese police and the government for taking care of us and treating us well during our time there. To President Trump and the United States government, thank you for taking the time to intervene on our behalf. We really appreciate you helping us out. I'd like to start off by saying sorry for stealing from the stores in China. Uh, I didn't exercise my best judgment, and I was wrong for that. I apologize to my family, my coaches, my teammates, and UCLA for letting so many people down. I also apologize to the people of China for causing them so much trouble. I'm a young man, however, it's not an excuse for making a really stupid decision. I don't feel sorry for myself, and I've learned my lesson from this big mistake, and I'm 110% sure that I'll not make a bad decision like this one again. First off, I would like to apologize to um, all the fans who support UCLA, because I feel like my actions have hurt them the most. It hurts me because I can see the pain that I cause them. I apologize to my teammates, my coaches, and my family because of how much negative attention that I put on them that they do not deserve. I'm sorry for shoplifting. What I did was stupid. There's just no other way to put it, and I'm not that type of person. I hope that this mistake will not define me as a person, but it shows that I have messed up and can learn from it. I don't want to be known for this dumb mistake. I want to be known for my respectfulness and my love and passion for the game of basketball. This event has taught me a lot, and it has changed me in a way that I can't explain. 